We'll move on to another one. Are you ready for Divines? I am indeed, yeah. Uh, so this, I mean, if, if you want to compare something very recent, uh, Girlhood. Yeah, Girlhood. That's similar, immediately what I thought. Similar themes, yeah. similar uh, you yeah. know, French female Bon Liu setting, but you can explain what it's about. Yeah, yeah. So um, it's uh, the first directorial film, well, the, the first credit by, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm going to butcher this name, aren't I? Oh, Uda Benyamina. Yeah. I think I've done pretty well there. Yeah. Well, yeah. Get, get in touch, yeah. Either. Yeah, sorry. I'm, 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 I'm usually apologise. You know what? You know what I'm like. But um, yeah, uh, it's in a ghetto near Paris where there's two friends, uh, Dunia and Maimuna. They uh, really, really want success. Uh, th there is a there's a scene early on which sort of sets out their ambitions. Where uh, it's much like the class. Mm -hmm. I thought like the the film we even watching for our uh, film study special topic uh, project where it's uh, Dunia stands up to her her teacher and basically berates her to yeah. death. Like, it's like saying, you know, you you go to this place to shop for your clothes. You're you're nothing. I'm going to be so much more than you. And uh, they get involved with a local drug dealer who slings dope, and uh, they, they sort of they, they build their you know they're going from rags to riches, and they've suddenly got all these massive dreams about going to far places. And uh, it it doesn't quite turn out to be as easy as that because you know being a drug dealer is not exactly uh, it's not glamorous. It's not a glamorous lifestyle, and yeah, I think I was really took by surprise for this one. I knew nothing about it going in, and. Uh, I think it's oh it's it, it it gets it gets really tough. It gets very to tough. to watch, doesn't it? Yeah, I mean because you have to think. I mean these these are these are kids. Yeah, like these are these are they are still these are still kids in in was it it's it's school or college? It's it, they're still in the education system. Yeah, still in the system. And it's it's really hard to watch at points because there is there, there does become violence, violence against Dunia and and my moon as, as the film comes on, and it's it just it there is there's nothing glamorizing about this. It's the fact that it goes from. The, the, the start you've got these two bright eyed girls and the film plays great strength into them as as a as, as a friend as a friend group that they, they are two great friends together they work really well the chemistry between the the two actresses is really really good and it sells you on them as friends it makes it all the more tragic when they are pulled deeper and, and grimier into this into this abyss mm. of, of drug culture and it, it, it makes no sense to glamorize this at all and it, it's all the more powerful as well when dunia finally starts to see to get herself a, a bit of a decent life as the film progresses with well, um, yeah. romantic prospect and this is one thing i, I kind of want to mention that, yeah that she she happens to be sort of in this theater spying on this dancer where yeah. she leaves the leaves the drug money um because at, at, at first they're spitting on them, aren't they? Yeah, they're, 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 they're up, laughing on them. They're up in above the lighting rig and they're just spitting yeah. down on them and laughing at them. But then he kind of becomes entangled with her and, and they have this little. It's, it's it's a very it's not, not not a great deal made of it. I thought like there wasn't a lot made of it as yeah. such. It has those bits where it's kind of and I know why it's used because of something that happens later on, which is kind of more to do with the drug dealing side of things. Yeah. But um, I uh, the interesting thing about her character and she's played by um, Ulaya Amara. Apologies yeah. again, but she she's fantastic because I think the film does a great job of making her look both. A, a very, very quickly switching between looking very young and very old so they can make her look like this very innocent adolescent child but also this sort of very you know like out of you know t made, made to look much older than she actually is to serve the sort of the world that she's kind of been trapped in with so it has that balance and I think that, that, that's a lot of her performance being very mature it's and also very immature screen, isn't it because you see yeah. her early on as this school kid and then later on as the film progresses there is an event where she is required to dress up and, and bring her hair down mm -hmm. and she suddenly becomes this much more mature woman I think it's such an amazing performance in the way that she she, she has that sympathy for and she's Dooney as a character is so driven and, and ambitious that you, you you really you you really don't want anything bad to happen. But it's a difficult it's a difficult watch. As it? as is the the nature of the business, so to speak. It's it's really bad. Like it, I think I think Junior is a, an immensely sympathetic character, even if she can be a bit of a you know a well, stubbornness. Yeah, th this is one thing I want to raise as well. Yeah. I mean, the stuff that she does, I would say, if you're going to compare with Girlhood again, it's it's yeah. far more extreme than anything that happens in Girlhood. Yeah. As in, you know, there's cars being torched. Uh, there's the ending which I'm not going to speak about. Yeah. There's something that she does to somebody in a ho in a in a apartment, yeah. which is like what out there. Um, it's it's very extreme, and I, 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 the the whole sympathy thing. I don't know. It's it's difficult. I'm not sure how I felt. Yeah. Because it, it's out. Shades of It's, it's out of circumstance that she does mm. these things, but they are very extreme, yeah. and it, it's 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 de it depends how you feel. It depends how you attach to it. But I, I like her performance. I like the film. Um, I, just, I just love them as friends. Like I think the, the story off of them is I think there and there's, there's one scene where they pretend that they're in a car 
yeah in, in thailand isn't it and uh, they're, they're driving along with all their newfound cash and the way the camera moves and that is, is terrific and i think it just it captures that sort of misspent youth kind of mm. vibe you know like the, the, these are you know blossoms who have been blown apart in the wind of <laughs> drug culture I had a really good metaphor for that but just, just I think disappeared it, I think in the went. wind <laughs> like a candle in the wind anyway um that's divine <laughs>